The eCover Creator by Laughing Bird Software. The eCover Creator will help you create all kinds of great looking covers, software boxes, magazines, thin books, fat books, CDs, and so much more. If you've ever tried to create your own e-cover, it gets pretty complicated and pretty expensive when you're forced to use Photoshop. The e-cover creator goes way beyond creating just the 3D graphics too. You can make your own Facebook posts, Pinterest, or Instagram size graphics, and even your own sales page graphics. Here, let's take a quick walkthrough. Okay, when you first launch the software, over here on the left, you're gonna find e-cover templates. So the first thing to do is to create your cover. So find one of the 50 templates. Let's try this one. It loads up and you can modify anything on the canvas. For example, if you don't like this color background, choose format canvas and we'll make it a different color. You don't like this graphic, delete it. You don't like this graphic, we can delete that and come up here to the eCover elements. I'll explain these in a second, but for now, let's try eCover Extra Elements, and we'll bring down, I don't know, a heart. And the background can be a little bit lighter if you want to, and change the text. Implement, and we'll format this. And we'll come up here again, and we'll choose another background. Software Box Backgrounds. And let's try this red. Bring it down. Send it to the back. And make it a little bigger. Now, we're going to come up here and we're going to export this as a JPEG. It's our 2D template. Export it as I love my job. All right, you're going to notice that if you've saved it to your desktop, it should appear on your desktop. Here's the graphic. And by itself, this is pretty cool. Now, we're going to map it to a 3D box. Now, we're just going to come back and select another set of templates. This time, we're going to pick 3D e-covers. Here, you're going to find over 50 different 3D graphics. So let's just choose one. And you'll notice a gray area here, drag an image over this area. Now here's the fun part. So first you're gonna select the face of the book. And you'll notice it's highlighted in yellow. If it's not highlighted in yellow, this won't work. So make sure it's highlighted. Okay, what this is, it's actually a graphic that allows you to drag an image onto it. Okay, so if you move it, just place it back. Now go to your desktop and drag it right on top of the book. Boom. So the trick is to position the canvas, the whole creator software, so that you can see your desktop at the same time because you're gonna be dragging graphics onto the canvas. Now, let's say this isn't quite what we wanted. We wanted it to face the other way. So we're gonna go back and not save this one. Let's pick a different position. Let's try this one. Click it, it's highlighted in yellow drag it over it's looking pretty good looking pretty good still not quite what I want I'm gonna go back and try one more time let's try this one highlight this bring it on highlight this bring it on there now we're talking that's what I like okay once we have our graphic on the canvas we're gonna export it again this time, we're going to go up here to the File menu, and we're going to choose Export a Transparent PNG. That will remove the white area. Export it, and it's here on my desktop again. You can use this for anything you want. But let's make a scene with this. Okay, we have a blank canvas. Now, we're going to go over here to the eCover Scenes, and we're going to find a nice background graphic that I like like this one, drag it down. Now you can make the canvas wide if you need to, or a little shorter if you want to. So now we're gonna import this again by going up here to the file menu, and we're going to import the graphic we just put on our desktop. 
import, find love books, and open it. Now I can move this around even more by scaling it. That looks pretty good. And I can add text. There we go. And let's say I'm not quite happy with this background because of the black back here. So I'm going to delete it. And we can drag other backgrounds down. Send it to the back to see what that looks like. Not bad, not bad. Or this background. Send it to the back. Getting better, getting better. And we can do a couple more things like add drop shadows to the text here. Cool. And when we're all done, we're going to export it one last time as a full-on JPEG image. And your final graphic that you can post on Facebook or Instagram or whatever you want is right here. And it looks pretty awesome. So that's the eCover Creator by Laughing Bird Software. Download it today. I know you're going to love it.